When you hear the name Vivaldi, you are probably thinking of some Italian dish. Well, you're half wrong. It's not a dish, it's a browser. Being named after the Italian composer Antonio Vivaldi, I think this is one of the most feature-rich browsers you have never heard of. It has everything you need including a dedicated email provider and a calendar built right in. And if you use a lot of tabs when you're working like me, it offers a lot of tab management options. Not only can you group multiple tabs together, you can actually use all of them side by side in a split screen multitasking view. All you have to do is select all the tabs you want to stack by pressing shift and clicking on them, then right click and stack them together. You can select all of them again and tile them side by side by using this tiny icon you see in the bottom right corner. You can see it creates a second row of tabs whichever have been grouped under one single tab. So this is literally next level tab stacking. They don't track your data and they don't even track your user behavior because they have no need for it. They are a company owned by their employees and there are zero foreign investors. Oh and they also have this really cool built in game which is like a merger between Road Rash and Super Mario. There are tons of customization options here, like you can really dial in the feel that you want. And even after all these features, it doesn't really consume a ton of RAM. It only consumes a little bit more than Firefox and it's on par with Brave. And without a doubt, it's lighter than Chrome. You can set keyboard shortcuts for a lot of things and even customize your own mouse gestures, although that may work better on a touchscreen device. It's available for your smartphone as well, so check it out. Like many good things in life, Vivaldi is underrated, so it definitely deserves your attention. So go ahead, check it out from the description and let me know what you think. You can follow us here on YouTube and on Discord for more videos like this.